Greetings of the day, dear goinkuns. In today's English class, we we'll learn a very important concept called essay writing. An essay is a piece of writing that is written to convince someone of something or simply inform the reader about a particular topic. An essay is a composition made up of several paragraphs, each of which has a collection of connected sentences in a given topic. The main points are introduced in the introductory paragraph and supported in the body and the conclusion is the last paragraph. Now most of us find it very difficult to begin the essay, to start the essay, how to write this, how to begin writing the essay. So essay should be written step wise. An essay is written on the basis of a given topic. So title plays a very important role. The title of essay should be apt and should not only give the idea about the main concept that is covered, it should also uh, capture the interest of the reader. After that, we should jot down the important points which we need to mention in our essay, which, need, which we need to include in our essay. After this, we need to understand that an essay has three parts and we should go stepwise. To begin with, the first part of the essay is called the introduction, which is the beginning of the essay. It, um, you know, clears the purpose of the essay. It introduces the topic to the reader. It is shorter than the, um, you know, following paragraphs. But in this uh, introduction, the reader, you know, comes to know what to expect from the essay. After that comes the body of the essay. It is the middle part of the essay that gives most amount of information and detail about the topic. It is the main section of the essay and it, it may have several paragraphs, two to three. And each paragraph can have many sentences which are interconnected. After that, the last part is conclusion. Conclusion is the last part or last section of the essay. It must end smoothly. It restates all the points which are mentioned in the body of the essay, right? It restates them very briefly and also signals the end of the essay. The reader comes to know by reading the conclusion that the essay is going to end. Here we also include our own thoughts in a couple of lines to end the essay about the topic. Apart from all these points, there are a few things which we need to remember while writing an essay. We should always use the outline to write the essay, right? Number two, we should use appropriate and good vocabulary to heighten the effect of our essay to heighten the effect of what we have to write then we should make sure that the words we are writing are spelled correctly the spellings are correct the sentences are grammatically correct it's very important to uh, take care of all these details so the first thing is we should refer to the outline second appropriate and good vocabulary should be used and number three we have to make sure that the words we are using and the sentences we are using are uh, words are spelled correctly and sentences are grammatically correct. So after all this, we should go through our essay a couple of times, maybe two or three times and look for the errors. And if we want to add some details, we can that do that as well. Now here we have provided you a template, a template where uh, which you can refer to. I'll read it out to you. My best friend is the topic. Here in the introduction, we will write about best friends so that the reader comes to know what we are, he's going to or she's going to expect from the essay. We have many friends, but there's always one friend of ours who is more close to us than others with whom we can share our thoughts freely, our best friend. So this is the introduction. Then we'll come to the body of the essay. We'll give details about our best friends and um, let the reader know our best friend through what we have written. My best friend's name is Saba. She lives in the house next door. She's very smart and clever. She has shiny long black hair and a lovely smile. I met her in the park while playing with other friends. We, uh, she uh, was very kind to me and we soon became very good friends. Saba and I know each other very well. I'm very uh, lucky to have a sincere friend like her. 
we walk home together every evening and enjoy each other's company she is very kind hearted and and is always there to help me she is uh, liked by everyone because of her fine qualities i think saba is the most adorable person in the whole world and i hope we will remain friends for ever here is how we will conclude we'll write a concluding line about um the best friend here i have written about saba so we'll conclude our essay by giving our own thoughts about the same i hope you understood it well and you understood what uh, how to uh, write an essay how to begin and uh, which are the different parts of the essay now we'll uh, practice a few more till we get it correct thank you have a good day